morning iFarm, welcome to today's vlog. I apologise if that starting was a little bit echoey, but you're joining me where I'm probably going to be spending most of this afternoon in my little toilet room. <laughs> if you watched yesterday's vlog, then you will know I started decorating in here and I'm determined for this to be one of those projects that's going to take me less than 24 hours because I'm really bad at starting them and not finishing them. Oh, I come out to see daddy, giving me a ride around the kitchen. <laughs> She's got all the toast all over herself, but it's okay. <laughs> we finished our breakfast and now we're going for a ride, aren't we? Hey? We're going on a ride. That's, it's not actually breakfast, it's 10 o'clock, her third breakfast. I was about to say, <laughs> all she wants to I do already gave a wee to Big this yeah. morning, which she didn't I'm going ride. Jace, you are getting dressed today. Jace didn't even get dressed yesterday, you know. I did, I did. You didn't. And you were, I tried to get you dressed and you was like, no, I don't want to. And then I thought, you know what, we're not going out. It doesn't matter. But you are getting dressed today because it's going to be lunchtime before we know it. Me, nah. Well, you are a little man. I don't want to. <laughs> I'm being towed by the new car and the new tow bar today. A little bit nervous, not gonna lie. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, today's turning into a little bit of a nightmare of a day. I got up this morning early at eight o'clock because I knew I had a really busy morning coming up. I had to take our caravan to, caravan, it's caravan dealer, so they can have a service done and have, have some warranty work carried out that was due on it basically. So that was supposed to be at the garage for nine o'clock this morning. And when I pulled the caravan out of the drive and went to hook it up to the tow bar that I had fitted on our new car yesterday, uh, or the day before, I can't remember what it was. Uh, anyway, when I had it fitted, when I went to hook up the caravan to the car, um, I realised that the tow bar company had fitted the wrong electric socket to the tow bar for the caravan. They'd fitted a socket for a trailer, not for a caravan. So I was super devastated at that point because it's not like, it's not near where I live, the tow bar place, it's a, it's a drive. Um, so I rang them but and they were, you know, they were sound and they were like apologetic and they said just come down and we'll sort it out. So I did, I had to ditch the caravan, drive up here and it was going to take a couple of hours so I had to ring the caravan dealer and make sure they were cool about me taking the caravan in late which they were, thank goodness. And uh, I came up here and dumped the car and they're really cool about, they're really cool this place because they give you a, like a hire car when you're here. So they gave me a hire car, the Mini that you've just seen me driving again. And I went home and cracked on with some jobs and I've just come back to pick up our car, which I'm in right now. And I'm about to go get back home, pick up the caravan and take it to the dealership. Very, very late. It's one o'clock now. It was supposed to be there at nine. Added to the fact that our, I had some issues basically with our vlog last night and, and it's still not edited properly. So I still need to go through the video and make sure that it's all good. So I hate days like today when I don't manage to get it all done on a night time because now the whole day is backing up. We've got the bathroom to finish today. We've got loads of jobs. There's so many jobs that need doing around the house at the minute that I really wanted to get done today and smash them off my head because um, you know when you have like loads of jobs in your head and they're just building up and building up and building up. I feel like that at the minute. I feel like I've got too much going on and uh, I really wanted to get loads of stuff done today but it looks like it's going to be one of them days where I won't even get back to the house after dropping the caravan off to like three. I'm going to have to sort the vlog out. Then the vlog will go live, then it'll be tea time, and then we'll have just no time left in the day. And I feel bad as well because I've also, obviously I'm leaving Sarah on her own right now, and she's she's she was just doing homeschooling, and meal has been really difficult. Nothing we can do about it, you know, I arranged to drop the caravan off early this morning so that we could avoid this, but unfortunately just, you know, things happen in life, don't they? And, you have to just deal with it, but um, but I do feel bad because I'm leaving her right now and she's she's busy doing homeschool and, and Mila's not been the easiest today at all, so she's got her hands full and, and I didn't want to have to leave her and, and do this whilst you know she was dealing with that. But we have to take it in today because uh, the service is due and the warranty work needs to be carried out and if we, we, we basically, we can't put it off anymore, basically it needs to be done now, um, so so the caravan has to go in today. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna get back on the road and I'll, um, I'll probably see you when I get back to the house. Okay, finally a few hours late, but we're hooked up. I'm ready to go. Not gonna lie, that just drove like an absolute boss. Like this car just drove, pulled this caravan better than the Range Rover did, hands down, smooth as butter. That was good, man. That was really good. Anyway, I've just got to the caravan place. I'm about to go drop her off and, uh, and get back to work, get back to it. But it's before I do. Oh, yes. She's absolutely massive, but it looks wicked. So glad. Love it. Okay, let's go. Hey, everyone. 
so I'm not too sure if we filmed this the other day. I feel like we didn't, but basically I, one of my Xbox controllers, like quite a few months ago, it broke and I don't really know how, it was Esme's controller and all like the buttons stopped working on it. Don't really know what happened there, but basically one of our controllers broke and for ages me and Esme haven't been able to play together because obviously we only had one controller. The other day, sorry, <laughs> the other day we, uh, I went downstairs and mum had a package and she was like, oh, well, I got you something. And I was like, okay, okay. And I opened it up and she'd bought me another controller so me and the girls have just been having so much fun um since we got it the other day playing together and it's really weird because i remember when, when i was lit when we were younger and we had like the xbox 360 and we had like the old like looking controllers and me and esme used to play minecraft together literally every single day after school like it was like a thing we did all the time and I have so many amazing childhood memories with that. And so it's just really cool now because we haven't played together in so long that we can play together on it now. So I've just been absolutely loving that the last few days. I also have been one, well, I feel like since 2020 probably, um, I've really wanted like, because streaming as well, I feel like in the last like two years has become like a big thing. And I've been like, oh, do I want a PC? Like, that, would that be cool to, to like maybe get one of those? And I've never really thought about it like seriously, but um, the other day one of my friends has got like a brand new PC and she was showing me on all the games she played on it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I really would like one. But then I was like, okay, so how much did um, everything cost? And she was going through like taking the mouse, the keyboard, blah, blah, blah. And I am so shocked at how expensive stuff is. One of, one of the gaming chairs, like a thousand pounds. Are you having a laugh? Are you having a laugh? A thousand pounds, pounds, a thousand pounds for a chair. Oh my gosh. And like everything all together, like the monitor and whatever was all like a thousand pounds um all together but that is insane i did not think it was gonna be that expensive i was like oh my gosh okay i'm gonna try to speed up the story but basically my dad was telling me that my grandpa has some p old pcs and I, I don't know if they're gaming pcs so i don't think i don't know how that works i'm so bad at technology it's not even funny but i think like a gaming pc works faster and it has better quality but anyway um i was like i don't want to be cheeky and ask him but i messaged him like oh well do you have any um, old spare pieces that you don't use I could use for like um, playing games on and he was like yeah I'll have a look for you he hasn't got back to me yet but I felt so cheeky for asking but I like honestly I really want one and I don't know if I'd like start streaming that I could maybe do that if people wanted me to do that I just need kind of game suggestions as well because there's only two games at the minute that my friend suggested which is Minecraft which I already play and Valorant I'm pretty sure that's called, but as a, I need some game suggestions, so comment down below any suggestions, and also you can go on my Instagram and message me some suggestions on there, Isabel I'm official, because sometimes I get like book, uh, book suggestions and people message me and stuff about that, so um, I'm always kind of checking through those. I'm honestly like, now that I've like set on the idea, like, oh my gosh, no, I could do this and I could do that and it'd be so fun, I could play with my friends and I could, like, I'm really set on the idea, so... If whatever, if it, so if the PC my grandpa has doesn't like work as good with games, I might try save up for one. Or uh, as well, oh my gosh, my friend, I asked her, please can you tell me like how much everything was so I can calculate how much it would be. So she's sending me like oh the keyboard, the mouse, blah, blah, blah. so all the stuff together like the monitor and the PC would was like a thousand pounds I think. And then she was like oh yeah but like the gaming chairs are a thousand. Some of the gaming chairs are a thousand pounds. Are you having a laugh? Are you having a laugh? So you can buy all of that setup for like a thousand but then just the chair could be like a thousand pounds i'm sorry that is insane i'd rather just sit on the chair that i've got like that is crazy oh my gosh um but yeah i don't know why i went on this whole rant i kind of just wanted to see if you guys would like me to do anything like that um i would have to get good at the game before i started doing that because it'd be really embarrassing if i could not complete a game anyway i finished in my school work this morning and i've just been ever since my tutor lesson yesterday i've been feeling so motivated and just like hyped in myself about school because it's just it's really like nice to hear someone um appreciate and like praise your work it, like it's honestly it's the best thing ever like it makes you just so much more motivated to work so i've been 
doing a bunch of school work this morning and I think mum and dad soon are going to start doing our downstairs bathroom and I'm really excited to see how it turns out because mum always has like the best ideas for stuff and when I went into the bathroom earlier I was like oh my gosh this is actually this is this is looking this is looking really good so I'm excited to see how it turns out. I've stopped filming our meals lately because to be honest it's been a very tiresome few weeks and when I'm very tired and feeling like, you know, things are a bit stressful, I just can't be bothered with criticism. <laughs> and every time I show like meals and things, it's always met with like criticism from people that really don't matter and usually don't matter to me at all. But sometimes like when I'm on the edge, it like pushes me <laughs> to my limits. I've not wanted that, so we've not filmed any meals lately. But we've had some corkers, haven't we? We've had some really, really nice dishes lately. I have posted a couple on my Instagram today just because I was stuck under Mila when she'd finished feeding, she was fast asleep. And I was starving. So I was just looking from my phone at all the meals. Because like a geek, I do sometimes film them. Well, actually I film them sometimes for the vlog, but they just don't ever make the vlog for some reason. Um, my point is, is that I'm filming today's dinner, so. I didn't really need to film all that. All I need to say is we're about to cook dinner. And I'm making a chicken ear. I, this is not my own. This is not my own um, meal. I got this off of another Instagram page. I can't remember what the name is now. I just screenshot it. If I can find it, I will upload it. But I'm making like a cheesy, chicken -y, creamy -y pasta. And it looked so good on the post that I'm going to make it. We're only using, I usually like double all the ingredients. However, I'm just going to use one pack of three chicken breasts because everyone in our family prefers the pasta to the meat so everyone likes the pasta more so don't tend to do too much meat but I am going to quite big those ones so this is what you're going to need if anybody wants this meal or wants to do it themselves some parmesan, mozzarella, tomato puree, onions, double cream, a little bit of olive oil, some seasonings um, yeah. they're the seasonings, some garlic and some pasta right then let's get cooking And she's like, can I, I can I help? I'm no. Like, well, oh, she does no, help to me. No, don't use that. I wasn't doing that just because no, I was actually doing it No, she well. wasn't. Isabel does genuinely ask to help all the time. But tonight she's like, the last, in fact, the last few nights she's been like, is there anything I can do? Do you think if I got a Saturday job? Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I'm like, Isabel, what, what, what? <laughs> so she basically wants a gaming PC. I explained it earlier. Oh, have you vlogged about that already? Yeah, I vlogged it and I said that one. For like the last four or five nights in a row, that's all we've spoken, well, it's all Chris and Isabel have spoken about around the, around the table, this gaming PCs. Because before I was like questioning, oh, do I even want it? But now that I know I really actually do want it, I'm like, oh, God. She's like, I really want it. She just said, um, do you think if I, if I started doing a Saturday job, how long do you reckon it would take me approximately to save up for a, a gaming PC? <laughs> Isabel does actually have a bank account with her own money in, but she's not having that before she's 18, so she's only 16 now. So, <laughs> here it is. Yes. But um, yeah, Isabel's trying to... Uh, Let's see what I'm saving up for. If you want. <laughs> One minute, I'm saving up for... For a birthing ball. What? A birthing ball. Gym ball. Yeah. A ball, so, I was confused. So, <laughs> yeah, I probably shouldn't have called it a birthing ball, but that's what I know <laughs> the most. Um, but yeah, when Mummy was pregnant with Jay, she had like this massive, massive human sit-on ball. A birthing ball. Yeah, a, a, a birthing ball. Um, and I really want one for my room because I can just imagine like trying to sit on it and I just really want one. So I'm saving up for it. Anyway, I, I, need to get the, I need to get the chicken on, so. As an early birthday present, then on my actual birthday I don't get a gift, a gift, because I've already got it. And then I could start streaming on it, because I'm a savage. Oh, Isabel. Yeah. Isabel. What? <laughs> You're not getting a PC. <laughs> just think She's like, and I can do my schoolwork on it. Yeah. And I can, <laughs> I can edit on it. Yeah, but you edit all right on your already. No, 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 because no, no, I have to steal that map book and then it takes time out of your job. So I am <laughs> solving the situation. <laughs> okay, I forgot your ingredient, guys. So this is also, we need some fresh mozzarella. Fresh? Is that oh, fresh? So is this fresh mozzarella? Uh, well, it's just not sure, grated. Sure, it is. sure. We'll go for it. Also, I saw a TikTok the other day, right? 
and I think I said this to you the other day when we made a chicken meal, but someone was like cooking this the food with the chicken and then it looked like that look. It looked like that, but just because it had like, been cooking and like they bit into it and they didn't even cook through the middle, so it was like Blech. pink in the inside. Chicken you really have to make sure as well. Yeah, because it looks like it's done that. Like that, you sit there and yeah. be like, oh it's done now, and then yeah. you cut it open, it's like Yeah. I love cooking together. You know, do it oh. together. Yeah. So really cool as well as learning some nice recipes. It's fine. It's fine. So basically if anyone's interested, onions and garlic, give them a quick fry. Shove in your chicken, shove in all your dry ingredients. Oh dear, what's wrong with Joe? Um cook your pasta. Oh, we need to get and take the pasta in there actually. Guys, this is the reality of what happens every night. I have to cook dinner all by myself. I'm forced to do it. I'm forced every single night. I have to sit here, cook every meal, and mum vlogs with me, and she acts like she she fil she act she films with me, and she acts like she makes dinner with me. But the reality is, it's just it's just me. Okay, I'm obviously being sarcastic. Mum does help me. She's just gone to see me at that. But we're currently mixing pasta. It's so fun. And the chicken is looking, so, oh my god, it smells so good. Oh my god. <laughs> so I was just going in with it, going in with um, the paprika. <laughs> Putting a load on, I really like paprika, so I was I like going for it. doing that, like, wait, what? I was going for it, putting loads on, and then I put it down and went to pick up the chilli powder and picked up the paprika. <laughs> and it turns out that I was actually really going for it <laughs> with the chilli powder. This is going to be spicy. Um, and then Isabel goes, can we, can we watch it? Can we take it out of the pan and watch it? What? What? <laughs> I thought we could just like put it under the sink and like rinse it off or something. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Okay, so when all your dry ingredients are in, Isabel, you've made such a mess here. What? It's not me. No, it's definitely you. No, definitely. What? It stays, it stays the paprika that stayed the whole blue thing. Actually, yeah, we've made a bit of a mess on the hob. Yeah. When you've done your dry ingredients, put a a cup full of the pasta sauce, the pasta water, into the pan. Add some tomato puree. By the way, I don't ever like measure out ingredients. I just go for it with whatever well, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Put in the tomato paste, puree paste, and then which is what we're up to now. And then add in the cream. cream. Like, add in the cream. Okay, so when everything's in, it should look something like this. Yeah. Delicious, delicious. <gasps> and then, the Izzy, do you want to get the cheese? Get your mozzarella. Okay, you need both your grated. One way's right over, there we go, all over. Wait, the... no, 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 not yet, not yet, not yet. Okay. okay. I need to wait, need to wait. Tiny. No, loads more. Loads? Yeah. Yeah, but remember, decent we've got amount. Big, like, big decent. Rocks. But that's enough, can't wait. Wait, 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 wait. Isabel's tight with the cheese. No, I'm not tight. No, nope, you are. You think you're tight with the cheese? Look at this. Bomb. Hey, bomb. Whoa, chill out. You're going to end up splashing it on my wall. <gasps> oh, before I put it all in, can I try a bit of it? No. Uh, mozzarella, I mozzarella. Just wait, let me see how much I've got left. That's enough, Lizzie. No, 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 that's enough. Oh. That's enough. We need some on the top oh. to bake. <laughs> Chill out. And then we need to just wait now till all this melts in. Oh my gosh. Oh, so this looks so cheesy. Yeah. Cheesy. <laughs> it looks so good. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mila is. She happy. Oh. Goody, goody. Okay, guys. I think this is pretty much done. This is how it's supposed to look. All nice and stringy. The cheese is all melted in. If it looks a little bit thick, just add a spoonful of pasta water, which is what I just did. And then you're just going to put it all into an oven-proof dish. Mix it with the pasta. Put a little bit of mozzarella on top. Put it in the oven to melt it and then it will be ready to serve. Mimi's, what did you think of Mama's pasta? <laughs> Jokes. Mila couldn't have it. I put way too much spice in it. By accident and it was too spicy. So Mila had some of her little baby pouch bolognese type sauce. It's like an Annabelle one. Uh, and some pasta with our pasta. Didn't you? This is so good. She loves pasta. Pasta's her favourite. It was so good in fact that we've had to take off the sleep suit. Oh, nice put put the arm across there for her own modesty. But um... <laughs> I just said to Chris, we're going to need to bath her, and then I was like, oh no, we can't. So, um... my spiker baby. <laughs> so cute. So, basically, I'm going to let you guys in on a little secret. So, basically, Isabel's been desperate for a computer. Now, a bit random, but Chris's parents had, like, old computers, like, quite a few old computers that they just had over time and not got rid of. Are you not going to let me talk to the fat iPhone? Because I know, um, 
And so when she first asked for one, Chris just said, ask Grandpa if he's got a spare one. Two minutes, guys. I, I mean, I'm not really in the loop with this whole gaming thing. Is it just a screen she wants? No, this is a, no, no, it's not. She, she wants to be a proper gamer. She wants to be a gamer. She's obsessed. She's obsessed. Um, her and her friends that live locally around here game, I guess, and Isabel's got into it, basically. So I said, so Chris said, ask Grandpa if he's like got a spare computer um, and, and see if he's got a spare one basically that you can borrow or that you can have. So she messaged him and just said, hey Gramps, have you got a spare old computer that I can borrow for some gaming? <laughs> and literally like an hour later, Jane messaged Chris saying, we don't have a spare computer for Chris, for Isabel, unfortunately, but um, we've just bought one online. <laughs> We've, but we've just bought her one. Like, she's done really good this year. She's like studying really hard for GCSEs. If you want to call it an early birthday present, call it that. Um, her birthday is in September. But she deserves it. She's such a great girl. And she is. So it's arrived. And it's quite funny that Isabel's just not stopped. I'm so scared she's going to come down and hear me and the spires will be ruined. But it's so funny that she's not stopped going on about this and she's got no idea that there's one sat right. In fact, it's in the box. It's been sat there all day in the brown box. So we're going to surprise her with it. I would never just buy her something like this just for the sake of it. I know we always go over the top at Christmas time with gifts and presents and things for our children, but it's very rare that we'd buy them anything like toy-wise during the year, if it's not like a birthday or Christmas. Oh, she's coming down. Is that Isabel? Is that Isabel? Um, so she's, she's never ever in a million years going to expect this. Okay, are you ready for this? What's going on? Okay. What's, What's going on, on boy John? What's going on, boy John? Oh, right. Isabel Ingham. <laughs> Why is he filming? <laughs> yeah. That's for me on the phone, that's what she's saying. What? Happy birthday. Don't lie. <coughs> what is it? It's a cat. It's an early birthday present. <laughs> it's a cat. <laughs> what on earth is this? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, I'll tell you a backstory. So granny, <laughs> granny and Grandpa don't have an old computer, so they got online and they bought you a brand new gaming computer. <laughs> and shipped it oh, to the house. Oh my gosh! Are you actually having a laugh? No, it's a proper, it's a proper beast one as well. <laughs> they've proper, they've proper tricked you out with everything you need. Oh my gosh! Did. I don't even know what to say. Oh <laughs> you, don't, you don't have to say anything. Oh my god. Oh, thank you, obviously. We are nil. <laughs> oh, wait, are you on FaceTime? Were you just no, filming? No, okay, okay, I was like, wait. <laughs> You've literally got everything you need to start, to start proper gaming. That's Hannibal's. That's Hannibal's. Free gift. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Yeah. What's all that? What's that keyboard? We've been talking about what? this all night. We've like, been talking oh about this all god. week. Thank what? you so much. No, I What's you? that? Oh, oh I'm, about to, I'm just checking everything I don't out. know what any of this stuff is, I'm going to be honest, but... <laughs> yeah! We're going, you want to go sit down now? Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I'm just like, it's because I've been talking about it literally like the last few days, haven't I? Yeah, non-stop. And, I, and, I, and I, <laughs> I thought I was never going to get one, because they're like really excited. I don't want to know. I don't want to know how much you have to pay for these because they're so <laughs> expensive, but thank you so it's much. It's very cool. It's a very, very cool And yeah, you definitely can do your schoolwork on it, like you were trying yeah. to... Earlier on, so I can do my schoolwork <laughs> on it, and it'll make life easy for me doing schoolwork. Yeah. You won't even have to edit anymore. Oh, oh it's got gosh. LED lights on the side. Not, it's I like, know, it's so cool. It? It's like a... It's, it's like a HD one. LED monitor. This is so cool. For what, sorry? Oh, LED, LED monitor. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Whoa! I know where to put this, though. That's on the your desk. thing. This has been your desk. Yeah, this has been your desk. Can I put it on that white unit? No, it must have been your desk. Nah, this has been your desk, yeah. So oh, you can oh. sit and play. Okay, yeah. It's yeah. not optional, that it needs to be in the desk. It's not optional. Yeah. <laughs> it's not. It needs to be set up properly on your desk. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is so cool. I can't even do it. Okay, open my light and so I can vlog. But... Oh my, this is literally, I don't have the wide angle, so this is going to be quite zoomed in, but I don't even know what to say. I, 
can't even I can't even deal. Like this is actually amazing. Um and this is this is so weird as well. And I feel like people are gonna think this is staged because um and I was saying this to Dad earlier when he was up here setting it all up. Basically, earlier I was vlogging, which I've already seen, I was filming saying, Oh yeah, well I really want um a PC, blah 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 blah. And then at dinner, when I was having mum make dinner, she was I was talking to her about it, like, oh really bargaining with her basically to get a PC um, and get everything with it <laughs> and so she was playing along this whole time when I went when I told her I'm going upstairs to film about um, this PC blah, blah. she was playing along this whole time and she knew I was gonna get a PC and she said to me because you've done so much hard work this e um, this evening with like you know you've done good with school and you've done um, helped me with dinner I've got a little surprise for you so I went upstairs with Isla and we watched a Minecraft video and then I come back downstairs and then obviously you saw the footage of me Again, a PC? What are the, like, the coincidence? Like, the, the fact that I'd filmed it all day, I'd been talking about it for days, and I filmed it today, and mom, me and mum were laughing about it, um, when making dinner, and then I literally got a P I, I, I don't even have words. I am so blown away and just in so much shock, and I just feel so grateful as well. I just have amazing grandparents and amazing family, and I'm just... I don't even know what to say. I genuinely don't know what to say. Um, the thing is as well, like I didn't even think I was ever gonna get one because the money, you have to pay for these things. I was like, oh my days, oh my days. Um, and I'm just, I'm, I, I'm just, <laughs> I literally don't have words. I genuinely don't have words. I'm just setting up some games right now. We've got the good old Minecraft. Yeah, I need to download some other games, which I'm going to do. And me, I, me and my friend were freaking out. I was telling her, oh my gosh, like I've got a PC. And she was like, are you joking? I'm like, no, I'm being dead serious. Like I literally have one. So tonight I'm gonna set this up. I'm literally, I, I don't care what time it gets to. I'm staying up all night to play this. Um, Hi dad, I know you're editing this. I did go to sleep early, definitely, definitely. <laughs> Um, but <laughs> this is just so cool. All tomorrow I'm probably going to be playing on this and playing with my friends and stuff. But just thank you again to my granny and grandpa. We FaceTimed them before setting it all up and I just thank you so much because this is the best thing, like, ever. Like, I'm, I'm not even joking. This is the, the best thing just ever. Anyway guys, I'm going to end the vlog here again. I know I've said thank you a thousand times, but just thank you so much granny and grandpa for this because this is just amazing. I absolutely just love it thank you so much um but yeah i'm gonna end the vlog here if you enjoyed give it a big thumbs up and also please comment down below some new game suggestions i promise i will go through and have a look um and yeah just thank oh i just <laughs> this is amazing oh my god look at andy anyway guys i'll see you all tomorrow at 5 p.m good night guys Mwah.